Hello, I'm Ethan Clark. We will uh, be spraying some enlist today. So before applying enlist, I look for a number of things. One is temperature, two would be wind speed. Um, also look that make sure that there's no risk for any inversions, major temperature swings. Just watching out for those huge inversions um, that could be possible. You kind of stay away from that. And then, of course, making sure that there's not a heavy dew, anything like that. But really, it's it's a pretty simple product to apply. Um, as long as you stick to the label and do what it says, you'll have no problem keeping a clean field while you're on. So these are T-Jet AI XR nozzles. Uh, they are approved for enlist use. Uh, you don't want to really go anything over 60 PSI with them, but they do a very, very good job at getting good coverage, um, especially where you have a lot of weeds. So going in, I like to hit the beans typically before R1, R2. However, in this situation, they're right at R1 right now. Unfortunately, that's just that's farming in a nutshell. Doesn't always work the way you plan, but I like to kill things off and get a good post-emerge pass right before the beans canopy to get that field clean before those beans canopy. And with the Enlist program and with the tank mix I'm using, um, especially with Zidua in the tank, um, does a very, very good job at keeping clean field all season long if you can get it clean before canopy. I get really good. 